one of the great things in human history is we accumulate power uh, that's almost godlike. And one of the first things we set out to do when we're able to pull together a massive workforce is to literally change the landscape, literally build mountains. A pyramid is a simple thing on, on its face. It's a tomb. But this was meant to be a building that channeled and captured and encapsulated light. It was meant to be the sunlight in stone. The pyramid as we see it has steps in it. Many, many hundreds if not thousands of steps as it goes all the way to the top. But those steps would have been filled in and you would have had smooth sides. And those sides were filled in with the finest, whitest limestone that Egypt had. This fine white casing reflects the light and was meant to actually encapsulate sunlight and turn the king into the sun god himself. The amount of organization administratively, the amount of labor that you had to extract from your own population. Slaves didn't build the pyramids, their own people built the pyramids. The logistical ability to do this you have to think about cutting stone and how much you're going to need uh, in this case over two million blocks of stone and they're not all shaped the same size in order to build the pyramids successfully we had to have a firm foundation in understanding mathematics when we look at how almost perfectly square the base is the angles are almost absolutely 90 degrees. There is the ratio of the sides and the alignment, particularly, of the pyramids with regard to the stars. This structure was off of Magnetic North by just a small margin. And it's extraordinary that they were able to do that. They probably used the stars to help them do that. But we don't know the exact method. There is still a great deal of disagreement amongst Egyptologists about how the pyramids were actually constructed. The pyramid is a testament to the ability of people to channel great and vast resources for one particular reason. When our species is able to construct something like the pyramids, to look at that, I think, gives us a sense of the potential for our future. That it is in our capacity to become like the gods.